I'm Nancy Habouche with Tip Top Tux University. Today we're going to learn how to tie a traditional tie. We call this knot the four in hand knot. So the tricky part is, depending on how tall the gentleman is, this is going to vary how much tie you have to have saved here versus how long the tie is. So this is the hardest part is kind of figuring out where the tie is going to land. Because when we're done, the tie needs to lay perfectly with the tip hitting just the top of your waistband. That's normal etiquette for the length of a tie. So here's what we're going to do. We've got about this length, and I think we're going to be about right, but if we're not, we'll adjust. I'm going to take the long end over the skinny end, and I'm going to take that same end and just wrap it around again, forming the knot. That same side is going to come back up underneath, and that's going to become the tie. You just open this part up, becomes the knot. You slide the front part in, and you pull it tight. Shimmy it up to the neck. You can see I'm a little short, but that's how you start. So we end up with a nice little dimple in the tie. Now we know if we end up a little bit short, see how much extra length I have to play with in the back? If we end up a little short, we know we just need more length on this side to begin with. So I'm gonna take this up a little bit farther. So now I've got a little less tie on this side. I'm gonna repeat the same motion. I'm gonna go over the top, over the top again, back underneath, I'm going to put the end back through this little knot that we formed, pull it tight to make my knot, shimmy it up, and now we're right at his waistband. So then you can just kind of play with the knot to give yourself a little bit of a dimple, but it's a nice simple knot. So when you turn the collar down, it's a nice subtle dimple, not too wide, not too narrow.